Hey everybody, the other extreme event for the Halloween uh, special. It is a walk through the haunted woods. It features the Halloween version of Viseron, the uh, wolf. Uh, let's see, what's his name for this one? It's, uh, what is it, Rotbone Lily, Rot Dog Lily? Why can't I remember? Uh, let's go, Rot Dog Lily, yep. And so the gimmicks here are gravity barriers and laser barriers. So make sure you don't bring monsters with lasers as their bum combos because there are a lot of laser barriers to worry about. And uh, there is a lot of damage here, once again, because that's the theme for this Halloween event. So you're gonna wanna make sure you uh, have high damage and High HP. That makes sense. Um, the uh, the key to this floor I, or this dungeon, I feel like, is making sure you can uh, get your pinches between either uh, the monsters or the walls because uh, Rot Dog, Rot Dog, Rot Dog. I already forgot his name. Rot Dog Willy. Um, he he likes to be uh, against the wall, so you have a lot of opportunities to pinch uh, in between. The boss and the wall so uh, and uh, rock dog Willie has a lot of HP in his final form so uh, making sure you can take advantage of those pinches will be key and as you saw the that uh, meteor attack from the very beginning uh, that took out half of my HP and you know 90k HP is actually pretty high so uh, it's, it's no joke here all right so um, we're just moving along and like I was saying, we have a great pinch point here for uh, for Rod Dog. I'm gonna try to go against the wall, and well, got it. Got there in the second time, but uh, as you see, even even though that was a million damage, uh, probably only you know, a fourth of his HP. Yeah, around there. So uh, getting those pinches is pretty key. All right. Um, oh, break time. We've got some turtles. And actually, been if you've been following the Japanese news, uh, they're actually gonna get rid of those uh, uh, money turtles. Mm, kind of sad. Although even in the uh, the global version, they do auto sell for us, so it's not like you can uh, obtain those in our version. Maybe maybe through the Fen Hatcher, but uh, they can clearly see there wasn't much use to it. So bye bye money turtles. Alright, so this stage there are pinch opportunities, kind of like, uh, uh, what was it, Yamato Takeru's first stage of the boss where uh, you can pinch those two minions. And they, they do a lot of damage here as well, so uh, if you have the opportunity, I would suggest pinching them. But as you can see, both of my monsters uh, were kind of stuck up there. And the good thing is, we're able to get rid of the boss pretty easily. Um, unfortunately, Apollo is probably going to hit get hit yeah major damage but luckily fire type so she's able to absorb some of that damage and there you go the pinching opportunities there and I think yeah I try to go for the heart end up missing and just short of the other one not good all right this stage um, the those flower minions uh, they they do a decent amount of damage if you leave them uh, alone. So do try to get rid of them. Uh, see, ooh, yeah, that's a lot of that, that meteor attack. Pretty strong. Uh, opting to hit everybody, and luckily, even with the defense up, able to get rid of that dinosaur on the top right. And Ashura take out the flower girls, and now it's a matter of pinching to. Get rid of Viseron. Oh no, sorry, <laughs> Rot Dog Willy. Um, of course, it's a good idea to pick up the health and take on Willy at full strength. All right, and yep, that is a nice uh, pinch point down there on the bottom. And well, since Apollo is not a balance type, there's no opportunity to pinch, but. Uh, with Sanada's bump combo, that uh, near near distance spread shot, 
easy work. And yep, we're gonna go kill that dinosaur. And it should make the uh, last stage a little bit easier here. All right. And so the boss is on the top half of the map, but all of the minions are on the bottom half. And yeah, as you've seen, they do a decent amount of damage. So uh, you can choose which to go for, but I'm gonna use Apollo Strike Shot, who uh, uh, reveals all weak points, which should help increase the damage output. And uh, luckily that also applies to the dinosaur on the bottom. So uh, that's good to get rid of him easier. I opted to not use Strike Shot. I'm not sure why. Maybe that was one of those uh, pushed it, but it didn't actually get pushed things. Uh, Shingen unfortunately has the same exact Strike Shot as Apollo. So that's, uh, that's a bit of a waste. Probably a character choice miss there, but uh, well, I mean, Shingen's uh, bump combo is really nice here, and to be honest, I don't actually use him that much, so it was nice to use him once. And Senator Strike Shot, every bounce off an enemy will fire off uh, some spread shots, which is good enough to KO Rock Dog really. And the speed clear, uh, no max luck monster this time. I don't think I had any good fire monsters, so opted for the safe team here let's see the results uh, three out of four pretty good and yeah there you go that should be it for the extremes um, I'll probably put a small compilation video for all of the uh, savage quests so uh, hope hope you uh, make the best use out of these Halloween events and oh, voucher. Meh. Until next time. Bye bye.